Stephen Eskenazi joins me at the end of the blast game against Hampshire. Stevie, a really tough day for the lads out there. Yeah, very difficult. Um, outplayed from, from ball one, really. We thought it was a tricky wicket. We thought it nipped around early. Um, and we thought, you know, they bowled well in the middle, experienced spinners. And with a decent finish, we thought we had a competitive total. Turned out not to be the case. It wasn't our day. Always going to be difficult being stuck in there. Did you set yourselves any targets as to what you thought might be a competitive total before you set out? It's really difficult here, obviously, with the nature of the outfield and how big the boundaries are. You know, it can be an average surface and it can still be a 170, 180 day. So we still thought we were going to need to get around 170 or 180 to be um, competitive. As it was 145, we would have had to have an unbelievably good start. I mean, they were batting on a different wicket. I think that's a comment on the way we bowled and also a comment on the way they batted. Yeah, we looked a little bit short in our lengths today and, and when we tried to adjust, we ended up pitching it in the slot. And You've got two batsmen there in McDermott and Vince that are in pretty good form. Uh, both put on 124, I think, against Sussex. They really cashed in. Yeah, I don't think the boys would mind me saying we just weren't the racers at all. Um, didn't bowl our lengths whatsoever. Kept getting hit square, kept bowling exactly where they hit hit all their runs. Um, we knew that from playing against them and from looking at foot, footage and doing analysis. So, yeah, really disappointing mis-execution. But you're yeah, the beauty of this format as we go again on Thursday. So no baggage going into to that game. Absolutely. It's a fickle format. I mean, the margins are often very small. We won our opening three games. We've lost our next three games. We're just as likely to bounce back with a win against Surrey on Thursday. But a, a stiff test that'll be. Yeah, absolutely. Fantastic side um, filled with superstars. But, you know, it doesn't mean too much. It's just three hours of cricket and anyone can beat anyone in this format, as we've seen. So, yeah, look, we go into that still confident, still understanding that we have absolutely nothing to lose. We know it's going to be a, a really difficult game there. They've got star quality, but we've got guys that can win matches um, off their bat and, and with the ball in our side. So we just hope that we can go there and, and you know, enjoy ourselves in front of a, a home crowd, which would be fantastic to be back at Lords. Um, yeah, and put this game behind us pretty quickly, I would have thought. Absolutely. Lesky, last one. Uh, we're hopefully going to be boosted by the return of Owen Morgan on Thursday and possibly Tom Helm as well, who's obviously on the back of a, a nice length of recovery from an injury. It'll be great to get those two back in the mix. Yeah, Morg's obviously a fantastic cricketer. Um, hugely, hugely important to, to what he does with us, both off the field and on the field. You know, his middle order runs. I think credit to Jack Davies today. He played a fantastic knock. Um, but Morg's coming in and strengthening that middle order is going to be great. And obviously Helmy, we missed him massively. The experience at the top of the order consistent performer for us over the past five or six years so as I said yeah we've got some guys that you know go toe to toe with the best in the world on their day too so if a couple of us fire on Thursday night we're as, as big a chance as anyone winning that game. Absolutely mate Steve thanks for coming out to joining us never easy after one of those but really appreciate it and good luck on Thursday. Cheers thanks.